What are all-in-one Medicare plans and are they worth it? That's what I want to talk about in this video real quick. Hey everyone, my name is Jamie and I am a licensed insurance agent helping seniors with their Medicare insurance and it's October. So what does that mean? That means that you're probably getting inundated with information about the new Medicare plans for 2020. Here where I live, the commercials on TV are starting to roll with great frequency. And one of the commercials that I saw the other day, I wanted to just share about really quick in this video, and that is the all-in-one Medicare plans. Now this particular commercial highlighted some of these Medicare all-in-one plans. And what you need to know is that a Medicare all-in-one plan is a Medicare Advantage plan. So there's two types of options for you when beyond original Medicare that you have. You can either enroll in a Medicare Advantage plan, and when you do that, that HMO or PPO a lot of times will manage all of your Medicare, or you can stay on original Medicare and get a Medicare supplement plan. So when these commercials roll talking about uh, all-in-one Medicare plans, they tend to highlight some of the benefits that are included like vision and dental and sometimes even gym membership. But one of the things that I noticed about this particular commercial that was left out, and this is the most important thing when it comes to all-in-one Medicare Advantage plans, is they didn't reference what's called the MOOP, M-O-O-P. And what that is, is your maximum out-of-pocket expenses. Now, why is that important? Well, the reason is, is that because with Medicare Advantage plans, there are deductibles and coinsurance. And depending on which plan you choose, you could pay upwards of $6,700 out of pocket on that Medicare Advantage plan. So it's something that you'll definitely want to consider when you are trying to pick which Medicare plan is right for you. The number one question that I always ask seniors that ask me questions about Medicare is, when you're choosing a Medicare Advantage plan, you wanna know specifically what the maximum out-of-pocket cost to you would be. And the reason that this is important is I get phone calls regularly from people who are frustrated with paying out-of-pocket and they would like to switch the plan. And unlike Medicare supplement plans, once you're enrolled in a Medicare Advantage plan, you can't change that plan until the open enrollment period. So it is an important thing to remember. It is something to consider. So when you see those ads that talk about the all-in-one Medicare plan, just remember you need to ask about the out-of-pocket, uh, the maximum out-of-pocket that you would face. I hope that this video is helpful. If you like videos like this, be sure and hit the like button. If you have other questions, feel free to leave a comment below. And as always, subscribe so you get the latest updates. Thanks, have a great day.